had 3% kidney function and they were telling me they could fail at any moment. And I always wanted to have my head face, everything done. But that was just the push that made it possible. This is gonna be the first time I've seen myself about tattoos for at least 20 years. Whoa, man. What? Wow, man. Jesus. My name's Steve. I'm 35 years old. I'd always wanted to be covered ever since I was a small child. I'd seen the old guys on the bus were like, love it, on the knuckles, and I'd always wanted to be coated, but my mother was deadly against him. She said, not until you're 18, and then I fell out of her about a month before my birthday, and I got a tattoo done in kind of rebellious fashion. I'd got all my hands and neck done, and I'd done everything else. It says King Capo which is my nickname. But um, my kidneys failed when I was like 30. I wouldn't have done my head and face otherwise because I didn't have a, 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 a full career or, and plus my mum and dad, they just, they, I didn't give, have a reason to tell them why I'd done it and, and that was a good enough reason when uh, my kidneys failed, like, cause uh, it all went a bit belly up. I just got really ill over a Christmas 20, 2016, after I'd done my test telling me I needed to get to hospital immediately, they were treating me like gold dust up there because apparently I had 3% kidney function. So, and they were telling me they could fail at any moment. So then I got my face blasted because <laughs> like it's way too short. Like I have to take immunosuppressants, which keep my kidney at bay. Um, but I look after myself, I work out as much as I can and I eat really well and just do everything I can to uh, to keep it strong. I, I never liked my reflection in the mirror too much. I didn't, I always wanted to hide. First first one was that crown with a skull there on the right side. The ears, I've got all the tablets, which is meant to do with like the kind of medication I take. I've got the evil woman screaming into my ear. She's meant to be a, like depression really, more than anything, everyone has kind of bad times. All these gaps up on the face are all gaps as far as I'm concerned. It's all gonna be filled out eventually. I'm gonna get my tattoos covered today and I'm excited to see the end result. Hello there. Hiya. So to start off with, we're gonna use an orange concealer just to counteract the colour. Looking more like a tiger. <laughs> then we'll go over with a pre-mixed skin tone that goes over the top. A lot of people do tell me that they were intimidated or they were scared. I have some regular looking arms and now we are moving on to the head and face. I think it looks decent, but uh, if it scares some people then you know it's kind of unfortunate I guess. Are you ready? I'd say so, as I'll ever be. Three, two, one. Oh, flipping now. <laughs> He's gone a bit browner than I thought he was gonna be with. But I don't I don't hate it. I wouldn't want to look like this in public, but <laughs> I don't hate it. I've got a decent jawline though. You really can't, doesn't look like that. I've got any tires, does it? Really, it does look uh, like they all have disappeared. I have three friends with me today. Two of them I have known for a very, 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 very long time, since school, since nursery. I think a lot of us sort of live by, oh, we better not do this because of my job, or I might regret it when I'm older, but I think, obviously, what he went through, he, um, None of that sort of matters. You know, you've you've had a brush with, you know, mortality and you just sort of think, you know, what's more important? You know, you just want to live um, the way you want to. And uh, it's inspiring, really. It's it's really good. But when I'm out with him, I don't even notice the tattoos. It's other people that you can tell notice the tattoos, but if you're like walking down the street with him, I don't even see him. <laughs> Whoa, man. What? Wow, man. Jesus. That is, wow. that's different, man. That is so different. Like you. <laughs> you don't look, no, you don't look like you 
Uh oh. It's like jawline and all, can, uh, yeah. Man, man. Yeah, yeah, all yeah. features and everything. Cheap, you look a bit like a hitman, mate. Right? <laughs> Some sort of hired killer, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think you'd cross the street if you saw me like this more than if you saw me. <laughs> yeah, honestly, yeah, I'm sound with it. I'm, I, I like, I'm quite surprised of how much I do like it. Um, I really didn't think I was going to like it at all, but yeah, I'm tempted to get it all removed now, to be honest, and uh, look like this burk all day long, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> All the health implications did was just gave me the the push to be able to get it done. But I wouldn't have done it without just the sheer realisation that life is way too short and it can go at any moment really. <laughs>